hey guys welcome back to my channel so today's video I'll be well I already went to TJ Maxx so it'll be a shop with me going to TJ Maxx today and I picked up a few things so at the end of the video I'm going to show you what I got but first I'm going to show you the things that were in the store there was some makeup there was a lot of fall a lot of fall which I love so let's get into it I guess Halloween has come into TJ Maxx have a lot of hand soaps liquid hand soaps and I like this one this one is Blood Rose Hand Wash, $4.99. Yeah, these candy corn scented bar soap. This one is $2.99. Have a lot more soap. These are bars. And then we also have here the same Blood Rose soap. $3.99. Have these, these are really cute. These are pumpkin oatmeal exfoliating bar soap. These are $3.99. Really cute. We have some makeup. We still have the subculture palettes for $24.99. Have the Anastasia Glow Kits, $24.99. Here, Too Faced Cocoa Powder Foundation in Golden Light, $9.99. We have some NARS Bronzing Powder. This is $15.99. And we still have some Honest Beauty Everything Cream Foundation, $12.99. This is an almond. We have some L'Oreal True Match Lumi Cushion. Haven't seen these before. These are $3.99. Also Maybelline Dream Cushion Liquid Foundation. $2.99. Here are some brushes. A few brushes. And I think we have here quite a few from Real Techniques Brush Cush. We have a fan brush, $5.99. We have the blush brush. Have this one is $5.99 as well. So here we have plenty. We have plenty. And we have some more over here. And we have here some of the Too Faced Melted Latex. The High Shine Lipstick. For $5.99, we have Rated R by Felicia. This one is Hot Mess. We have Twilight Zone. That's about it. It's looking a little empty here today. So coming here into the skincare, I just saw this the Pure Clay Mask from L'Oreal. I had actually gotten one of these. In a haul I did, which is for Publix, which the items were for one dollar, but there was only one left, and I really liked it. I was running low, so now I see it here, and it comes with a free travel size. And here you have it for five ninety nine. It's not one dollar, but it's better than the original price. And we have here, I guess, the mask section, peel off mask and charcoal. I guess the dark containers. See, so we have here some charcoal peel off mask, $6.99. Peel off mask, which this is the brand that I got, have it here, and the one that I have. The peel off mask treatment, 24 karat gold for $4.99. I had actually already tried this one and it really, really irritated my skin. I did a peel off of this one which I'll link below. 
think the only way this one worked was only putting it on my nose area. But everywhere else it was very, very irritating. You have a lot of fall here as well. And here are these guys. See here, retail price is $25 and here it's $12.99. So very lightweight. We have some velvet pumpkins, $9.99. And here's some other little guys also retailed for $25. They're here for $12.99. Halloween section. See here this sugar skull. It's a little bit heavy. $12.99. Made in India. And we have here some candelabras. We have this is twelve ninety nine. We have here another little section, a lot of pumpkins. Had an old man flirting with me right now. <laughs> so then here we have for Thanksgiving. We have this guy, very lightweight. Two of them, and these are $9.99. So I have a white pumpkin. This is $9.99. Should really nice. Then we have this one, bless this home. And look at this one. This one is $14.99. And we also have these guys, which I actually really like. Let's see. This is $24.99. It's a little bit steep for my liking. And I also liked this sign. It says, Give thanks. Really, really nice. And we have this one, $14.99. Here we have some more. I just see they're all over the store. I have some more pumpkins, a smaller white one, $4.99. I have this yarn one, it's $4.99 as well. And we have the velvet one in yellow. $7.99. Here, bigger one. I have here for $6.99. Here, another little section. The home section. A bit of pastel blues and whites. So, we have here this glittery one. Thankful. It's for $9.99. have this dusty light blue. Count your blessings. This is $9.99. Have some more. This one is $9.99. So it is just pumpkin season everywhere. A lot of pumpkins. Have this one for $9.99. This glass blown one, $6.99. Another one, this is $12.99. This one is really pretty. Have this one for $9.99. And here, crisp air, $12.99. Only not existed in Miami. It's currently 95 degrees here. We have a cold one, $7.99. Have this one for $9.99. A lot of pumpkins. This white one, $12.99. It's actually lighter than I thought. 
this one's actually really pretty. It's like a white lace. This one is $9.99. <laughs> More skulls. It's like a little mason jar. I have these for $1.99. Really good price. So we have here a lot of makeup organizers. I had to get a shopping cart. <laughs> Couldn't hold everything in my hands. So we have here a multi-use organizer, look at that, for $9.99. Then we have these, we have six compartments, multi-use organizer, $7.99. Bathroom organizer, this is $5.99. And we have this large, it says holds 36 lipsticks lipstick holder you have this one for $7.99 you have this other one a smaller one I have this for $4.99 then you have another one also small this one is $4.99 this one holds about 18 lipsticks yes, 18 lipsticks and we have these larger ones, multi-use organizer, like that. Have their $9.99. $9.99. Then we have here like little drawers. It's four drawers. And have this for $12.99. There. And we have some other ones in the back. Let me get to it. We have these. This one has three drawers, a large one here, two here, but then also this up top. And then you have this one for hmm. So there's no price on this one. Let's see the other one if it has a price. It's $16.99. All right, guys, so now to show you what I got. I did pick up some things. As you saw, I had some items in the carts. So I actually wasn't planning on really buying anything. I was just going to look around, see if they had anything. I was actually looking for a brush holder but I didn't see any that I really like. I did like that mu that skull, like the skull cup with the lid on it, but I don't know if I want a glass brush holder. Knowing me, uh, I don't know. <laughs> so I guess on another little trip, I'll have to look for that. So let's start with the first item. This was the biggest one. I did end up getting this guy got this one there was another one that was also for $16.99 but I like this one a little bit more this one has the has two drawers long ones here and then these other two smaller ones here and then up here it has another has like a top part which I would think comes apart if you want it like that so since my makeup is growing, growing a lot, I'm just putting it wherever I can. I'm putting it, I have another one of these at home that I got from the container store and I already filled that one up and I have really, really big palettes. So what I did is just put them behind and my lipstick collection is growing. So I keep looking over there, I see a guy walking around. And my lipstick collection is growing and I'm just, I don't know where to stick them. So now I have a few here, stick here. So I'm happy about that. And since I reorganized my bathroom, I now have some space to put this. So there was that. And then 
to continue with the organization for more lippies because my collection does keep growing so I got this one this was for 18 lipsticks and this was for $4.99 it's a simple little acrylic which I had already one of these but of course I filled it up I don't remember the one that I have how many it is I think maybe about the same I think it's about the same and then still with the organization makeup organization I well this is not for makeup it's for your desk Let's put papers or folders but I have giant palettes I have a lot of eyeshadow palettes and also face palettes so I thought maybe I could organize them here and this one was for $4.99 see they had this one they had it in a light blue they had it in black pink so I chose this I guess kind of like in kind of gray kind of gray I wanted to go with white a little more neutral but they didn't have any white so I went for the next best thing in gray because I don't have a home or a vanity and I don't know yet how I want to decorate it when I finally do have one so for now I'm just buying neutral colors until I decide what color scheme I want so then with skincare I did end up getting this guy As you saw this is the L'Oreal pure clay mask purify and mattify which is one that I had gotten at I had gotten at Publix they have their clearance section they had a lot of stuff for one dollar and I had seen one of these there so that was really really exciting that day when I found this for one dollar but sadly there was only one and I actually just used some of it the other day and I noticed that I'm running really really low so I picked it up here and then this one comes with a little travel size and this was for $5.99 not a dollar but still beats the original price and then when I was at the register making the line they did have some makeup there and I noticed from afar that they had some some Kat Von D single eyeshadows, the Metal Crush. So when I was paying, I quickly just went back to look. And to my surprise, I'm so excited. They had it in this shade, which ever since I first saw it at Sephora, I fell in love with it. It's an emerald shade. See it there. This is the shade Iggy. And sorry I'm a little bit shaky I'm hungry and when I'm hungry I think I get about low blood sugar so I had fallen in love with this color but I wasn't going to pay the price tag on it there at Sephora and then when it went on sale they just didn't have this shade anymore and then I saw that this shade was being discontinued and I was so so sad so sad because I really really liked it so when I saw it here I had to get it unfortunately it was only one because I would have gotten two it was for $6.99 just like the other shades that I picked up so here we have it again sorry for the shakiness and you have there the shade it's really really pretty So, so pretty. Let's see if I can swatch it here. We have there this gorgeous, gorgeous green. Because usually with eyeshadow palettes, you have, when you have a pop of color, you have a lot of blues, but never greens. So I wanted one like this, and now I finally have it. So, so, so pretty. I'm so excited. And I still have a lot left over on my finger. So, excited.
excited about this little find. And that was it for my haul for today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Please remember to subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. And don't forget to click that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you never miss a video.